what's up everybody we just completed our first camp yoga session led by the amazing sandra it was awesome my arms are burning a lot of people think yoga is just stretching but it's a lot more right how'd you feel oh man it was tough i had a million things going through my mind while doing the yoga and sandra mentioned to me you don't you're not supposed to be thinking <laughs> <laughs> my triceps are on fire that was where i had the most pain yeah. a little bit in my wrist the most challenging one for me at first was doing the V, holding myself up in the V, just feeling that pressure and weight on my, my just triceps and arms. Yeah. And then after that, it was the chakra, is that? No. Or the, where you drop down into the- Chaturanga. Chaturanga. Half Dropping plank. down into that half plank. Man, everything was getting real, real weird. Yeah. But it was so great after, I mean, I felt this is our first time, Bradley and I, in a while doing yoga. Years. Yeah, so I felt I was going in and out of my body's freaking out to, oh, I feel, I feel zen and then freaking out. So <laughs> I know with practice and stuff like that, I think it'll be an awesome that's process the point. to go that's through. That's the point. What we want is to, to get you out of your comfort zone, but at the same time to find that, right? Yeah. To find and control that, okay, your mind uh, going in and the breathing. I mean, that's the yeah. hard part. Remembering to breathe. Remembering to breathe, <laughs> you know? Bring it in, bring it out. And not to think about it. Like we were talking about in the beginning, right? Yeah. So when you elongate, you inhale. Mm -hmm. And when you um, when you flex, flex yeah. you exhale. So that's what I, I try to remember. My body like a xylophone. Like when, yeah. you ex imagine. when you stretch out, you, you exhale, right? Is that? Or you inhale. inhale. And then you exhale. Mm -hmm. When you flex, mm -hmm. inhale, exhale. Mm -hmm. How long have you been doing yoga for? Now it's 13 years. Okay. Jeez. Yeah. What got 13 you years with it? Ago. Well, wow. it's because, um, actually, because after I had my second kid, it was I was in pain, con mm. always, constantly in pain. So I tried everything. So somebody mentioned, that, why don't you try yoga? And so I was like, okay, I'll give it a try. And in a week, I started feeling the difference. And it was more, I think it was more my mind that I was going through a lot of changes in my life because it's brand new baby. And you, you know, it's like, oh my God, a lot of things and new uh, uh, schedule and, and pain everywhere. So I started in a week and it started going away. And so from there, I never stopped. It's like, even though I don't go to yoga studios anymore, I practice home, and that's, I mean, never stop. Yeah, so I can feel how it could definitely, uh, it's gonna correlate to doing HIIT training exercises and doing weightlifting and just, I felt more aware of my my space when I was going through the flow. I felt like I kept going there. There's sometimes where it smells, felt smooth, and I, I, probably by accident where my breathing was perfect when I moved, you know, I was like, oh, Oh, that was easy. And then other times my breathing body. was off and it was just ah. Let's your body, right? Yeah. Yes. So try to get in that the flow down, practicing that. You guys practice that that video we've got, you know, that fifty minute long video showing the flow and just practice the movements and Yeah, and we'll we'll post our uh, the the workout that we just did, the yoga the yoga session we just did so you guys can follow along with us. Mm -hmm. If it's your first time, this is a great intro video we also have the intro to yoga video on there as well that we go through the movements so that you know them before you start practicing them very important yeah, yeah. and this is just the beginning i mean i just really just test a little bit of the water you just put your finger there this is just the beginning and the more you do it your body start getting to it it will get you get to the point that you don't even think it's like you just float and like we can be adding more and more to that flow, you know, and that's that it's a part of it that it can be for an hour, not stop it, bring it more, bring it more. And the more you learn, your mind opens up, your body, you're controlling the whole body. Remember, it's not just entire physically, it's mentally. That, that's why it's beautiful because it connects the three things, you know, yeah. mind, body, spirit. That was, no. a, that was the first time in a while, I'm not gonna lie, you know, being the first class that part part you know, part of the class, I'm sitting there like, why am I here? Like this hurts, <laughs> this is weird, this is because I'm just not used to it. But when it comes to doing any other sort of working out, running anything, I'm like, yeah, I'm in the zone, but this 
it brought me back to like first class of PE of like, what are we doing? Why am I here? Like, I don't want to be here. Stop. But I can't wait to get to that point where it's just Natural. bliss. Yeah. It's just, Natural. Yeah. yeah. And, and that just comes back to it's super important to change it up every once in a while. Yeah. If you're doing hit training, hit training is awesome. Throw in a yoga session every now and then, right? Or, or throw in a heavy lifting session every now and then, just so that you can shock your body and have yourself nice, well-rounded, healthy, strong, stable body, mind, spirit. Spirit, oh, yeah. yeah. The connection is it, it, different, very different. If you guys are, uh, if you guys are out there and you're not able to do the full flows, I mean, you watch the video, you see me and Bradley. We're taking our breaks, you know, left and right, dropping into that child's pose. Yeah. You know, don't be intimidated by that. You know, they're hard movements of holding your body. But at the end of the day, keep practicing this because you want to get used to your body. You want to be comfortable in that body. And that's that's what I'm pumped to get out of this. And this that that meditation, when I was done, I was just like, oh, yeah. felt very peaceful. Yeah, nice. felt a lot more Stress peaceful. Stress just relieving really? my fingertips and body. Yeah. <laughs> the feeling is completely completely opposite of what when you left and you have a hit class you get out of it and you have so much right. like oh mm -hmm. want to keep going mm -hmm. with with yoga it's like okay i can take it you know yeah stay bring it in whatever it is nothing's gonna move me out of my zone and then the end that's what you really want to learn it's not about controlling it's about learning whatever comes you're just gonna work the best not get out of the mat what you might is surrounding and be in beats all the time. Yeah. yeah, that was killer. Can't wait for a second class, guys. Yeah, have fun. Keep keep safe out there, guys. Thanks for coming. See you next time. Bye.